It has been said violence has no place at home. But unfortunately, it does exist more than we believe, and which more often than not creates a destructive lifestyle pattern. That's where the Brooks RCMP and the Domestic Violence Intervention Team come in. We put it into place in October of 2012, and since then we've been um, assisting families that have been involved in domestic violence, both uh, through the courts, through the police. Canterra Safe House, which is a women's shelter here in Brooks, has a partnership with uh, the RCMP in Brooks. Domestic violence call comes into the police, the police respond, they investigate, they may lay charges, they may not. Uh, at that point, they secure consent from the people involved, basically saying, if this stuff is happening, that it's bad enough for police to come out, you obviously need some supports. At that point, support staff are activated to contact the family. But this is where the Divot team, as they call it, takes a different approach. It's one of the unique uh, things about our program is that we deal with the offenders, and not too many other programs do that. When they do a risk assessment with the offender, you know, suddenly they've, they've lost their family, they've lost their house, they may have lost their job. Um, suddenly their risk is substantially higher than, than the victims or the families. Our motto here is the best safety plan for a victim is to provide services to the offender. McNulty said there's no timeline for how long or how successful this program is, but the stats to support it are staggering. Well, this year alone, the uh, Canterra Safe House and the Divot program combined have provided services to over 95 men. When we first started in October, we went after two, two families, two groups, that made up 80 calls, 80 calls for service from the police in the previous uh, 12 months, roughly. Following the, the domestic violence team's intervention with that, those two families, we had one call. The, that story in itself is, is everything as far as I'm concerned. So I think 40% of the files that we've dealt with over the past year, um, they've been involving not just men, but men and women who have been suicidal. 40% um, of the files that we've dealt with have experienced some kind of sexual abuse. We're saving a ton of money in, in response. Uh, we're not putting our, the police members in, in harm's way. The family is much healthier. Um, I think the headway is, has, has been simply amazing, to be honest. Um, we have had community participating, not just the service providers, the professionals in the field, but the whole community has rallied around this cause. For more information on the Domestic Violence Intervention Team, contact the Brooks RCMP. For Go Southern Alberta, I'm Dave Dawson.